The following is an Ice on Mars presentation. Hey everybody, welcome back to Overtly Mocking Games, OMG, this is Michael T. Bradley. This is Skix Maddox. And today we're going to be looking at Broken Sword, number one. There were multiples of these. I had never really heard of this, and then I happened along it and thought, yeah, this this will probably work. So here's hoping <laughs> it's not amazing, because <laughs> that would be a little disheartening, and we'll just kind of sit here in ashamed oh. silence. Wow, yeah, we... We are not worthy to crit criticize this this piece of beautiful art. But I think it has a lot of French people in it, and so oh, that's well, always... Yeah, just wrist from the mill, if you will. Ba and this is played by... Eating... Yeah. <laughs> I was try trying to build a stereotype, and I, I just failed, because I, I don't know why. Your heart's just not in it anymore. I no, understand. it's not. It's not. We're not 15 anymore. No, and Doing it's... our... You know, wearing our striped shirts to middle school doing our mime impressions in order to play off of stereotypes and you know we're just I, too woke for it to be funny anymore skicks I, I i did do actual mime in high school <laughs> we had Is a world it? we had a world famous a world-class mime in our neighbor in our town and he came and he taught the drama club i always just think of robin williams from shakes the clown but Anyway, beside the point. <laughs> beside the point is where I live, baby. This is played for us by Geekmeister. So hey, that's, Geekmeister uh, that's, again. Uh, uh, yeah, it's like coming home again, really, at this point. <laughs> Paris in the fall. The last months of the year and the end of the millennium. All right. The city holds many memories for me. The visuals Wars. are stunning Wars. here. Music of love and Wars. death. And whores. <laughs> Applied to all of those. Whoa, here we go. Revolution! Yeah. Also, which century? End of the century? There, there are a lot of centuries this could be the end of. There are a lot of centuries, yes. The Shadow of the Templars. Oh, yeah. Oh, That's gonna be those. Good. But Templar, the Catholic butt monkey, devil worshiper, money hoarding. That uh, was like a coy gargoyle there. Well, they are in France. So, yeah, definitely Paris, huh? Yeah. Paris or, or someone's, like, uh, desktop, and they've got all these commemorative, you know, building models. All right, game. I am not doubting that this is parent Paris. Paul Porter? Oh, but no. The, uh... Gosh, at one time I could have told you the names of those bridges. They're Ponce something, but I, I can't remember. Ponce de Leon? No. But they do keep their youthful vigor. Alright. Okay, so this is just kind of names. Like, we don't... Skip, skip, skip introduction. Barrington Filau. Yeah, it's a It's, it's a cool mixed name. ancestry uh, sounding sort of name. Yay. Usually you can't see the curvature of the Earth, so this this game was made solely to say F you to all the flat earthers, I think. Yeah. Whoa, this scene is edited way too quickly. That's a lot of cuts for a cartoon. Ah! I'm the devil. Devil. Do French people have that kind of clown? <laughs> I need okay. me some hands like that. What? Penny, oh. Pennywise just stole some money and put a bomb in the place. This is, that's decidedly Batman villainy there. For sure. The bomb in his squeeze box. <laughs> Mama's got a squeeze box. Daddy never <laughs> sleeps at night. <laughs> well, we know he survived because he's blonde and blue-eyed. Mm-hmm. This is actually okay. German. As I picked myself up, all I could hear was the ceaseless drone of traffic. Where? Life went on around me. <laughs> I'm more curious about the phallic uh, uh, kiosk in the background there. Or giant firework. So, sure, I don't really see life going on around him at all here. The leading article referred to the visit of a Nobel Prize winner from some unpronounceable Eastern European state. That was the only news <laughs> story. The rest was rumor, gossip, and sensationalism. Then I noticed the page five had a naked woman. 
It read Salah ed 1345. I know that, like, if I'm in Paris and there's a bombing in a cafe near me, the first thing I would do is pick up a newspaper and check it out. There's a person moving in the background. Sure that's a person? Looks like an animal to me. There's some kind of repetitive movement in the background. <laughs> oh, the other blonde. You know she survived, too. Right. I tried not to meet his stare as I searched the dead man's pockets. No wallet, no papers, no credit card. I could finally LARP some D and D. But I did find three gold pieces and a map to a different uh, layer. Who says spirits anymore? Pretty young waitress was unconscious. Well, this is the turn of the century, Skix. A century, yes. That's yeah. I turned her century something good, if you know what I mean. No. Oh, no, uh, she's a real doll. I, I'd like to imagine it's the turn of, like, the next century. This, uh, this is sort of like a, a, a LARPer convention. How much Everyone's... vodka did I drink? No, don't tell me. This is like Spider-Man 2099, except without oh, Spider-Man. American. She asked the question Why did she have a bowl cut? But I is that usual for zero. turn of the century Frenchies? Afflict all Europeans. You look like you could use a little help. <laughs> With a haircut. <laughs> did he get trapped in the in a echo chamber there? I don't even remember the party. Lady, your place is bombed. Don't don't be making fucking like roofy jokes here. <laughs> is that an explosion? Was? You should try not to move. Are you a could you, in fact, could you I, get closer to the microphone? Not only should you try not to move, I really I shouldn't pull, have pulled you over well, to the bench before checking if you're doing medical you minds on this hurt. planet. He How's your spine you doing? Know about medicine. Can you remember anything at all? No. But it is strange that I started speaking brain. English when I first woke up. You could be in <laughs> shock. No alcohol. Okay, you're the doctor. What about the old man? Is he dead? He's a yes, blank slate. Oh, mon dieu. I like how you click Man. the thumbs up. Is he dead? Thumbs up. <laughs> yeah. She didn't respond. Put that open mouth if on I her head. Another cappuccino, I'd have... Wow, everybody is so fucking blasé about this bomb going off. Oh, blasé is a French word. Such a slinky little finger like, oh, you want to go here? You want to go here? Yes, you do. Bistro Cafe Tamales? Cafe Tamale. Just like in <laughs> real France. This is a sinister a alleyway. Old trash can. That's no way to I talk about it. your mother. I could start a trash fire. I like the little circular garden in the middle of the alley. <laughs> That's France for you. Might be a cesspool, it like, like someone had dumped sewer. A truckload of fish in a locker room on a hot summer afternoon. It's no way to talk about your mother. <laughs> oh no, a cat scare in an alley <laughs> with trash cans. Who'd have thunk it? I was really hoping we you would say like it's an annoying black-haired pussy, and then we could go for the hat it, trick there. Yeah, we'll have to wait a little longer for that. Oh, it's a... Man, it looks like grass. I tried to lift the cover with my fingers, but couldn't gain any leverage. Perhaps it's because I'm weak. And blonde. I gotta go do, like, 50 reps at the Y. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Could they have gotten, maybe, a slightly blander actor, I wonder? Unlikely. Or I'll shoot your nuts. I'm I'm an That's I not demand, that. Huh? No. I demand to see the American consul. <laughs> Drop your weapon and get down on I'm the ground. Innocent, I'm an American. <laughs> That's <laughs> so not something you could say today, anyway. Sergeant Mew? It, like, he's just always got a look of distaste. En avant to the cafe. March. I don't understand your crazy French words. No, well, I'm just over here digging into the bank. Don't mind me. It's like the French have a different word for everything. <laughs> well, excuse me. Stop holding your breath at once. <laughs> <laughs> Has it occurred to you that he may?
may be dead, move. Oui, monsieur. But I prefer to look on the bright side. Besides, I recall Always look on the bright side of life. Death. Apparently, that's However, a popular song to play case, at funerals. Is quite dead. Clearly, the killer knew of his well, that's all right. Yeah. I warned you about premature extrapolation. Ooh. Look, it happens to everybody in their like, like 30. It's fine. The real trick about that is to just do it again. Just, just don't be done, and it's okay. He was a fictitious character, monsieur. Why? He was no more real than Poirot or Tintin. That's a different move. They were Tintin 220. Anyway, Alright, so this dialogue is pretty good. What the hell is it doing in this game? Examine the girl and take her statement. It really seems like two completely tonally different games. Like, first off, there's the horrific bombing, which we survived magically. I guess maybe maybe this is like an unbreakable game. George Stobart, I'm from California. That's an America. And what brings I tell you, they're protected by their blondness. Travel. Slightly different shades. You chose well. The city is most beautiful at this time of year, no? Uh, yeah, I guess so, apart from the bomb blast. When the, the, the well, gendarme pulled a gun on him, I thought he was getting mugged, and it reminded me of a, yeah, a friend of mine who traveled, I was lucky. He took I a year off college and traveled in Paris, and he was mugged in Paris by a, a little person with a knife. Um, and yes, I it's did. just was he an odd story uh, that he likes yeah. to tell and did he say anything <laughs> no to you? that's as far as no, the story goes i'm afraid more interested in the waitress <laughs> oh okay. did you see anyone else in the cafe does the uh, detective look kind of yellowish to you yeah there was a guy yeah. dressed as a clown he was carrying an accordion an accordion He's like a french bon. charlie the chan is maybe in my mind and it is not a pretty one is not drawn for me like one of my French girls. Is the girl all right, <laughs> She'll leave. She confirms the doctor's statement. We? I mean, they were standing like five feet doctor, away from each you? other. Uh, no, that's right. I didn't think it was relevant. All doctors are to be put in the pen immediately. What do you mean? I am satisfied that you know nothing. Hey. You may leave. Enjoy your that's vacation, sweet. Dr. Stobart. But I'm from California. Can't you at least give me some advice? What can I say? He doesn't really hey, sound uh, Californian to me. No, not at all. He sounds like a British person doing an American really accent, which is great, weird right. because then it's like, I are these be British be people doing French no accents? Danger, Maybe. Should you remember anything of importance, please contact me. My card. See, like, you can't live in California and have that particular hair and not talk like a surfer. I, I think there's a, a, a statute. That is all. You may go. Brah. There's not much or there's also a, a form of Californian that looks like that that uh, sounds a little like Slovakian. Like, I'm from Pasadena. I'll take you word for it. Are you serious, monsieur? I thought your interest in Why does everybody sound like they're in an echo chamber when they stand in that part of the room? You are about to witness. That's Ooh. echoing out of her hollow head. <laughs> well, anyway, I'm off to continue my tour of Europe. Oh, look. It's like a French god person. Yeah. Look, go talk to the interesting character before she leaves. No, sir. The inspector gave me specific instructions to guard this door. Until he countermands these orders. He's just gonna walk in circles until he approaches her. Understandable. He ran into the alley across the street. Did you follow him? I lost him. I figured he went. There is no clown. Underground clown. The rhymes. Great city. It's not a question I've lost sleep over. CSI Underground Clown Patrol. CP. How did you oh, I see that thing in the background is that guy digging the dirt. Yes. You arrived within minutes. 
Was it a tip -off? She's taking That's photos. Sources are I'm here for end of the century <laughs> magazine. There are some who say he has made a pet yeah, she's just kind of walking devil. that same triangle. What do you think? I think he is the devil. Oh. Okay. Maybe this is going to take like a Gabriel Knight turn and I'll suddenly get some demons and shit. The ones over, as you are oh, oh, really? Well, hey. Hmm. Once he gets his teeth into a case, nothing will shake him off. Um, Was he serious about all that psycho detective stuff? To be fair, like, our character could just sidestep, like, three inches and see what the detective is doing in there, right? Seems that way to me. I also think the gendarme might be curious about the woman taking pictures of a bombing site. I was one of the last to nah. see the victim alive, Sergeant. I, I guess pre-9-11, everybody was just much more... <laughs> Bombings were just not that big a deal. Yeah, they're just blithely going about their day. Did he speak to you? Tell you anything? Like, just a random, angry clown. That happens. You gotta, you just gotta accept that. Underground clown. Go home and try to forget. I found this in the street, Sergeant. That, monsieur, is a newspaper. No. There's a note written on it. Salah Eddin, 1345. It's written in clownish. So, the meeting with the clown was planned. <laughs> How do you make that out? The time of the explosion was between half past one and two o'clock, n'est-ce pas? I guess Oh, so. he ruined the joke I was so trying to form. what about the name? Aha! That stumped you, hasn't it? 1345 showing us what century, but it's in the middle of the century, so it's, you know. It is the name assumed by the clown, no? Salah Eddin, the clown? I don't think so. It's not a clown name. Maybe it's a French clown name. Are, are French clowns Excuse usually me? Arabic? I don't. I mean, they're, they're much they more ethnically be. diverse yeah. over there, I think. <laughs> Hi, my name's George Stobart. I'm from California. You think? That's right. On holiday in Paris. Some holiday, huh? How come when he talks, the sure upper was. part of his head moves like a muppet instead of his jaw? I couldn't believe it. She hadn't even asked how I was feeling. What? Yeah, <laughs> what a self-centered brick! <laughs> God damn it, woman! What about my feelings? I am Nicole Collard from La Liberté. What's that? Some kind of nightclub? <laughs> no, it is a newspaper. It's, come on, You're he's been taking pictures behind you for like ten minutes. Say, you can I used to be a freelance photojournalist. You know, and I in a very small town. Minutes after my the my big pictures were um, a road you know, crew like and an old lady who stood on the corner with a sign I saying "No War." Thank you. <laughs> Did you see who planted the bomb? Not in the same shot. It crazy, it's the top it of everybody's head that moves, not just him. That's bizarre. Have you met Maybe this the is like before? Jim Henson it's presents. Jim Henson presents it's underground it's clown it's terrorism. <laughs> you speak very good English for a French girl. Thanks. You speak very good English for go. America. That's what I would have said too. Do you know a police officer called Rosso? Rosso? A pass have a knack of crossing. If I Rosso looks like a mad scientist a down below. Have you seen Rosso? Is he here? He really does. Inside. Attempting to question kind of a clown scientist. Like a I think those yeah. are lapels, but it looks like his hair. Guy is weird. Yeah, he kind yeah. of looks like Dr. Willie. Oh. Who's the guy you were supposed to meet? His name was Planter. Uh, so we don't say that him, anymore. He That's so rude. He said he had a story which would interest me. Dr. He asked Willie? Me to meet him at the cafe. Plantard. I guess I'll never know what he wanted to tell me. Uh, not unless you have Rosso's gift for psychic interrogation. Stop sounding so derisive. Why won't you tell me about this clown? <laughs> Why do you want to get involved? I, uh, I mean, fair play. That me. does you mean that there's a bit of acting going I guess on. So. Listen, I'll give you my phone number. It's or a bit of head trauma. <laughs> Are we dating now? Me with my story Stop dressing like a whore. <laughs> and let's get one Stop dressing like my now. sister. This is strictly business. Okay, it's a deal. I have to go develop these pictures. A bientôt, monsieur. Fine, I'll uh, they're not putting in the accents soon. on the French. Lazy. They aren't? It's accented to me. A bientôt has a accent circumflex on it that was not there in the text. It's one of my favorite Duran Duran songs. <laughs> You're Hi. a dork. Can you spare a few minutes? I thought you'd been arrested. No, it was a misunderstanding. When he pulled that gun, gah! 
I thought Kamaki, those automatics by quite a bunch, you know? He made a mistake. He thought I was a terrorist. I'm you a Californian. A terrorist? Ha! He was only doing his duty, People I guess. People who look like him oh, are actually much more likely to set bombs in this country. I don't know about Paris. Let's not talk about people doing their duty. Do you know what he duty. Said to me? That's what he's doing well, in that hole. Fascinates me, he said. <laughs> I could watch it all day. Beat. I could have knocked this block off. Beat. Shh, I can't remember. My French is so many years ago. Man? No. Should I have done? Was he a celebrity? No, but I guess he is now. His name was Plantar. Was? He's dead then? Yeah. That's too bad. <laughs> now I wish I hadn't called him what I did. If only I could turn back the clock. If only I'd been more tolerant. <laughs> if only I hadn't eaten all these marbles. The hammiest actors and people. <laughs> you think? What did he Is call him? Clown oh, I want to know what he called him. A clown. Like, in a circus? Yeah, with no. makeup and a big red The nose. other type of clown. Oh. The, the French for clown, I do remember. It's clown, which makes it very easy for them to understand what he's talking about. You haven't answered my question. He hasn't seen answered You much. think I've got time to watch everyone who passes by? Some of us a lot of yes, sir, no. <laughs> Look, I know you're busy, but surely you'd have noticed a clown. I told you already. I didn't see a thing. See, you had to no, you if you be quiet, I gotta get back to singing hi ho while I do this. Clown if he didn't. <laughs> Listen, I have to He's find like the grave clown. digger. He's a killer. Say, who are you anyhow? A cop? No, of course cop. not. I mean, do I look like a cop? Well, I guess not. you look like a California. How do you know this guy's a killer? <laughs> Did you see him in action? Didn't you hear the explosion? The cafe was blown up. The clown killed the old man. Is that a That's restroom right, right behind a our character? No, that is. <laughs> now, maybe. But why did he go to the bother of dressing up like a clown? It seems to me the sort of thing that they sometimes put up around an open manhole cover when they're working in it. it's some deep-seated psychological need. But I don't know. Or just plain showmanship. I think this guy's the clown. I think he just Would ran like away really fast, paper? stashed the clown outfit, and went back to a hole. I haven't digging. got time to read that. Can't you see I'm busy? No. You could read it on your lunch break. Ten minutes is all I get. And if my boss had his way, I wouldn't get that. We've He'd been talking for it, ten minutes. So I didn't have to stop to eat. Oh, take the newspaper and quit complaining. Yes, all I need, eh? <laughs> Look at this. Damn bleeding out liberals. We should blow them up. Save the dolphins. Catch Remember them. when I Save the, the Dolphins rest. was the main All thing that, that liberals talked about? Bunch of fish. <laughs> ah, Simpler times. Like Look at the and or more those. ignorant. Like champagne bottle corks. No. Ah, what's this? Saladin running in the Prix de la de Triomphe. It's a racehorse? A horse? A legend. Bucephalus reborn, mon ami. Like a streak of lightning, she is. If... If I met someone, me say, from favor, France, right? Keep an eye and I don't know French. I'm off or, and I did know French. I don't think I would pepper my talk with cute American phrases all the time. Like, like French people in movies always do when they're talking to us, you know, like, you know what I mean, mon ami? It was a yeah, the, uh, I was actually recently, um, reading a, a, an article by someone who was advising writers on how to write someone bilingual, and they specifically said, yeah, don't do that. People don't do that. Yeah. They don't go, oh, como dice, uh, Spanish Spaniel. <laughs> they don't really do that so much either. Yeah. That Spanish I just did? Como se dice? I think that's Spanish. No, wait, maybe it's... Como se dice, man. Uh, maybe it is French. 